Hello, this is Damien from CJT Pro. Today we're going to discuss the header and footer output location hooks. It's this icon here and it allows you to assign your code block to either the header of the web page or the footer of the web page. So let's create a new code block, call it a name, show me the code, leave these intact, click create. Now I've got some a demo script, it's, it's actually a little bit of CSS3 and I'm just going to copy and paste that into my editor window. Before saving it I need to assign it to a page and I've decided to assign it to the contact us page. Click save. I'll click the uh, contact us page to see the result and as you can see show me the code appears in the header. Now I'm going to go back to the CJT dashboard. I click this function to go to the footer now. Again, click the contact us page. It's no longer in the header. I scroll down and there it is in the footer. So this is quite handy function that allows you to assign the code, the, the, the code block, should I say, to either the header, so it will um, execute early in the page load, or the footer of the, uh, so it'll execute much later in the page load. Now if you wanted to um, have more pinpoint um, output, for example, say you wanted this show me the code text to appear in between two paragraphs, then you wouldn't use the uh, header or footer and instead you'd want to use short codes. Now we've got um, a little tiny MCE button called the CJT short code embedder and it's really easy to use so I'm just going to untick that and then I'm going to go to the page itself and edit the page I'll make sure that I'm in the visual editor I'm going to click space and then click my CJT uh, block shortcode embedder and we want to uh, there's the code block there and it's now added the shortcode for us so update view the page and as you can see the, um, the, the, the script is now run in between the paragraphs. So you've got some choices um, um, to assign your code block to either the header of the page which is you know good for some scripts that need to run before other scripts or you can output it to the footer of the page. So for example, you know, analytics where it needs to run right at the end of the page load or more pinpoint um, targeting such as HTML code where you want it to appear uh, between paragraphs or after images or what have you. So a lot of choices there. I'll just quickly finish off by saying that when we're looking at the assignment panel, if you decide to use the assignment panel, in other words, you want to assign your code here to, you know, either pages, posts, categories, you know, or, or even the, you know, like entire website, the blog index, whatever it be, if you decide to use the assignment panel, then it will use the header and footer location hook and it will not use short codes. If you decide to use short codes, then short codes will, will bypass this entire assignment panel. Hope you enjoyed the uh, short tutorial. Thanks again. Bye.